What is Crackin' Lackin' Tackle family? Welcome back to the channel. Totally forgot to make an intro and an outro for this video, which is completely normal for this channel. But as you guys can tell by the description and the thumbnail of the video, I caught my PB Spanish mackerel from the beach, which I usually don't catch Spanish mackerel from the beach anyways. I usually catch them from the pier. I think I've caught maybe one my whole entire life from the beach. But uh, I thought it was pretty cool. I wanted to share it with you guys. Then I got checked by the FWC at the end, so that just made it even better. So anyways, Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Next time you see me, I'll be on the water. Woo! All right, y'all. Just got down to the beach here, Johnson's Beach. Uh, a little bit windy out here. Hopefully uh, we have some decent audio. I don't know though, we'll see. But uh, I'm gonna throw you guys on the chest mount and I'm gonna show you my setup. All right, so this is the setup. Frisky fins, pompano rig, white teardrop float, pink bead, little piece of shrimp and a little piece of sand flea fish bite. Three ounce sinker. That's what I got on this pole. And then basically over here, uh, three ounce sinker, same setup, frisky fins, little piece of shrimp, and then green fish bite, shrimp flavor. And then of course, don't forget about this. Come on, man. Every time. Like literally, every time I fish, it's always you. I'm not gonna call you Fred this time. I think today you're gonna be Jimmy. Hey, Jim Bob. Hey, Jim Bob. Jimbo, what's good? What's good, Jimbo? I'm gonna get you, I'm gonna get you. All right, first one going out. I really hope the audio is not destroyed on this. This one, I'm not gonna go super far. Looks like a good spot. I do want to get one over that second sandbar or that sandbar out there though. I know that. I might have to walk in the water a little bit to get it down there. I'll try to sling one, see if I can even reach it. Nah, there ain't no way. There ain't no way I'm getting there. I'm gonna have to walk out to get over it. It's a little bit of a hike, I ain't gonna lie. Whee. All right guys, I had to walk out here a little bit. I'm hooked up though. The sandbar, I, just, I had to walk out to the sandbar, chuck it over. Let's go. What is it? Bluefish maybe? Spanish? Spanish. Nice size Spanish too. Yeah, good looking man. This dude over here is telling me on the sandbar. Uh, whew. Look at that. It's a Spanish. A good size one. Come on now. Nice Spanish, man. Good looking out. Yeah. That'd be a mackerel dip later. No, okay, man, I appreciate that. You called it, man. You were like, hey, right over that freaking sandbar. They're all over. Oh, really? I swear I've met you before. You've given me tackle you found off the beach. 
<laughs> He's like, I run into everybody. That's a good size Spanish too. Thank you very much, man. Whew. My biggest fan. I saw you catch it. You running over. That's awesome. Look at that. That's a good size. Oh my God. Good size Spanish mackerel. Spanish mackerel. Look at the teeth. You guys eat it? Oh, yeah. I want to get a picture of that trophy. Whew, that's a walk out there. I'm out of shape. PB Spanish there, Jim Bob. Jim Bob, PB. Got my PB Spanish mackerel. I also got a little bit of lemonade here that my uh, wife didn't want, so that's what we're uh, celebrating with. What do you think, Jim Bob? Hey, Jimmy. Jimmy, I'm gonna get you. All right. Whew. It's a bit of a walk. The sandbar goes out forever. I could keep walking, but I could sling it to the, to the more open water. Uh, when I get back over here, I'm gonna put a tape measure on that Spanish mackerel, but I'm pretty sure that's my PB. I think my PB uh, was about 15 inches before, and I think that one's pushing 20 something. So let's go ahead and sling another one. Boop. And last time it didn't take no time at all. I mean, it was just almost instant. Then again, I might have threw it right in front of his face. Who knows? Hooked up again. Oh, this one's bigger. No, never mind. It's not bigger. It's small. Thought it was big. Felt big at first. Oh, it's got a little pull to it. Hold on. What we got here? Feels like another Spanish. Yeah, another man, a small one. Oh no, it's a blue. Blue fish. Easy, buddy. I'm trying not to put my reel down into the water. Some people, uh, some people say it's all right. It's a pin rod, pin fierce three, but I don't know. I'm just kind of weird about that. Putting it in water and putting it in sand. Even though I already did, I basically dropped it when I caught that biggest Spanish, bigger Spanish. Nice little blue fish. I don't know if that's a blue fish or a blue runner. If you guys know, let me know in the comment section down below. My guess it might be a blue runner. And then again, blue runner and blue fish might be the same thing. I'm an idiot, so. Let me down know in the comments down below. Look at that beast. All right. Let's see now. Probably help if I put the camera on it. Let's see. Oh yeah. I don't know if you're supposed to go to the end of the tail or the fork. Anyways, it's about 20, a little over 20 to the fork. I don't know if you can see that or not without my shadow. 20 to the fork and 23 to the end of the tail. So definitely my PB Spanish mackerel. Cause like I said, my last one was like 15 inches to the fork. And this one's 20 to the fork, so killed it. Totally killed it. Which makes me happy. Woo! What do you think about it, Fred? Jim Bob, what do you think about it? High five? 
High five. Come on. I'm get you. Get your big old pants. Oh, double dipping. You dirty son of a gun. Where the sun don't shine. All the moon shines still. There's a copper line hiding in the side of the hill. I apologize for that cringy singing right there. Walking back out here. You. All right. Let's sling another one. Out to the open water there. See if we can catch another fish. Hey. I think I'm already feeling a little nibble. Is that? I can't tell if that's a nibble or not. Absolutely beautiful out here. I'm rolling here. I got something else. Oh, fighting. Yeah. What is it? Another blue. Good bait. This guy saw me doing the arm thing and he was doing it with his plane. That's freaking awesome. Yeah, you're awesome, dude. He's doing light, he's doing circles around us. Oh, he's leaving now. That was awesome. It's like when you see a trucker and you do this. And they go, hur, hur. that's awesome. He's a big one. <laughs> uh, what's the word? Uh, this is kilograms, not quite a pound. Almost. Not even a half a pound. Yep. Exactly Point half. Five. Point five five. It's a new. It's a new record. <laughs> she would have been here the other day. Mm -hmm. Big Spanish. Yeah, I did catch a big yeah, Spanish in there. Yep. Uh, yeah, I haven't seen any Spanish in a while. Um, it's been a couple weeks, probably. Was it your last week when you got that? Um, not that long ago. Yeah, it was about a, less than a How week ago. How big was it? 23 inches. Hey, that yep. is huge. Yep. Yeah, um, I've mostly just been seeing, um, whiting, some pompano. That's my favorite is whiting. Yeah. Tastes the best. I know, that's what everybody says. <laughs> I like pompano too though. Yeah, me too. I like the I like the whiting though. Yeah. 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 yeah, more flaky. Me too. Alright, well thank y'all. Have a good day. You doing uh fist bumps here? <laughs> Alrighty, thank you very much. You have a good day.
all right dude and dudettes it's the very next day uh, i have my pb spanish here sitting in the ice bath overnight i'm gonna go ahead and fly it up get two nice fillets out of it and i'm gonna catch you guys back in the kitchen Let's take a little bit of this oil here Shout out to KJ for being my cameraman. Right oh yeah. Seeds and all, just leave it. Just like that. Beautiful looking, huh? And then, we're just gonna top it off. With a couple thin slices of lemon to cook on top. Like this, 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 this. <laughs> Oven, probably about 15 20 minutes. Good to go. That smells good. Go ahead and get this out very quick. I did cook it a little bit longer than the 15 minutes. I went about 25 minutes. Look at that. That looks absolutely amazing. Yeah. Let's go ahead and cut us a little piece right here. Look at that. Look at that. Flakiness. Ooh, it's gonna be so good. Oh, so good. So good. The skin on there too. Mm. Mr. Bone. Anyways, I'm going to be making some dip with it too, with the other side. And all it is is cream cheese, sour cream. I use the super blend. I break up the, uh, the fish and mix it all together. So that's basically it. Catch and cook, Spanish mackerel, PB. Really good. Tastes really good. Dip's gonna be good too. If you want to look up dip re dip recipes, YouTube YouTube's king. You know what I mean? So. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed that video. Me catching my PB Spanish off the beach. I thought the FWC checked me that same day, but it was actually a couple days later where I caught a bunch of blue runners, bluefish, hardtails. I don't know what they're called. Uh, if you guys know, let me know in the comments down below. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys could, do me a big, huge favor. Make sure you give it a big, huge thumbs up. Smash the subscribe button, and I'm going to catch you all in the next one. Holler.